Good evening, everyone. Oh, I was so off there. Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video where I've had a bunch of people saying, like, they've been messaging me all day. Code, Code, why did you play Fortnite? There are new presents inside Lumber. I, I know, I know presents are coming. Presents are going to be here. Like, <clears throat> no sense falling out of your chair for it. Did you get the pun? Did you get the pun? I fell off? No. <clears throat> I understand. I know that there's there's a lot of presents, but I haven't seen them yet. So, let's go over here. Avoid my tall bridge. <clears throat> Alright. Um, not seeing any presents. There are no presents. Oh! What's that? <gasps> Present! Okay, the gift of critically acclaimed knowledge. Gift of critically acclaimed knowledge. This gift makes you feel ready to brawl. Okay, <laughs> I'm down. Uh, I'm I'm excited. Oh, and they're all over the place. Eight oh five, eight hundred and five for this gift. Is this all the same? 8 of 5, yeah. So let's go ahead and touch all, all of them. There's another one right there. Are there any more? There's one more in the back. The back stack. Wonder what happens if we buy all of them at one time. Boom! Okay, Tom. Talk to me, talk to me, talk to me, Tommy! 4,025, yes. Got them all. Gotta catch them all. Like Pokemon. Did you get that? Okay. Let's go um, take these back. Here, I'll, I'll park the car a little bit better. That was a horrible parking job code. Bad job. Loading area. There we go. Ah, <sighs> good to see you again, Code. It's good to see you too, Tom. How have you been? I'm well. I've been under the weather lately. Really? Is it is it the is it the flu season? Yes, it always happens this time of year. Well, why don't you take a day off? Oh no, I could never possibly do that. I always work. You do. You work too hard, Tom. Too hard. We'll get you a we'll get you a present this year. Thank you, sir. <coughs> always been so good to us. <clears throat> uh oh. Some of his cars in the way. Excuse me. Excuse me. Is that my car? I think that might be my car. Oh, goodness. Okay. Like, we're not done. Oh, this is from uh, Grey Dog. Okay, buddy. <laughs> you can never have too many presents, can you? Oh, my gosh. Okay, maybe that's too many presents. <laughs> It's a lot of presents, just saying. Alright, jump out, jump in, oh, jump in. And all the presents for this year, oh, oh, are just going to be stacked right here. So, <clears throat> I don't need to worry about moving that truck out of the way because we're just going to re-res the truck up here. It costs like 800 or something like that. We've got 12 mil. We're okay. Boop. And off we go. Come on. Don't fall out of the truck this time, please. There we go. And we're off. So we need to go check fancy furnishings to see if there's anything new over there. Uh, the box truck. You can't buy anything from the land store because he doesn't have a counter. He, he's not the regular seller kind of person. Although that would be cool if he sold presents. Mm. Er, skirt, skirt. <coughs> there we go. Hello, Super Sir or Madam. I love how it says Sir or Madam. I should just say, like, hello, person. Hello, fellow Robloxian. Because I don't think Robloxian characters have genders, do they? I mean, yeah, I guess they do, because you have to select boy or girl. But I thought that was for your birthday and stuff like that. The avatar is not you. The avatar is a representation of what you are in-game. 
That's why it's always funny whenever um, I refer to people calling me Code Primate. I'm like, yeah, you can call me Code Primate. That's fine. It's, I mean, it is me. Ooh. Do we have anything in here? <gasps> no. She's got nothing. Jenny. Why don't you have any presents this year? I mean, this is where we got the big tires last year. And then uh, we got the big boxes the year before that. Any more over here? We got the two. I didn't even see what these were. Okay, this is the dark gift. All question marks. And this is, hmm. Wobbly con confidence. Okay, so I would say because of the packaging, this is going to be a wobbly head. And this is going to be a ball, but I'm, I'm sure it's going to be like dark color. The dark gift. Nothing else hidden, right? It is kind of strange how he set up the presents this year. I'm a little, a little concerned. Just a little though. Ooh, don't hit the edge. <clears throat> I'm on the edge. Of lonely. Boop, 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 boop. Stop, jump. Jump out the way. Nothing. 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 Hmm. Okay. Hey, <laughs> go do you buy presents for somebody? Yeah. I'm gonna put these in somebody's stocking. <laughs> Thanks. No, thank you, Bob. I have so many ideas of what to do with the explosions. <laughs> uh oh, I'm starting to sound like Bob. Okay. Mm. Now, I've never tried it, but there's a hole over here in the corner somewhere. Hold on. Yeah, right there. I've never done this before. Let's try it. Whoa. <laughs> Anything down there? No? Nope. Alright. That was pretty cool though. <laughs> okay. If I could survive it, I mean, I would totally use this as a means of transportation. Watch how far it sends a truck. <laughs> so fun. Fun, fun, fun. And he'll have fun, fun, fun till the YouTube takes his bonnetation away. <clears throat> oh, you spin me right round, baby, right round. That was awesome. I landed it. Oh, uh, skills. 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 Because <laughs> you gotta yell out skills. If you, uh,. If you launch yourself up in the air. I think I've got a t-shirt on uh, on my merch store. It says skills on it. I've got that on there. I don't know if anybody to get the reference. but Because it, it, I don't think it has like code primate or any kind of branding on it. It just says skills. So you'd have to explain the story. But it's only if you want to. By the way, um, the day that you're watching this is the day before my birthday. I turn 40. So I can finally say I'm a 40-year-old YouTuber. Or you could say you're that 40-year-old man on the internet people talk about. Hey, that's not funny. It's, it's hilarious. It's not funny at all. Let's go to the bridge. I, you know, I think that's one of my favorite voices to do, is the, the old man prospector voice. There's gold in them here. There are hills. There's gold trees and then there's swamps. Um, was there a particular reason I picked up the dynamite? I mean, I don't really... Hmm... 
Yeah. You know what? For fun. For glory and for fun. Because I don't think... Um, Link never has anything over in her store. If somebody goes over there and Link does have something inside her store, please let me know on Twitter. I just, I don't feel like running all the way over there today. Actually, you know what we might do? We might go visit the lighthouse. <gasps> you guys want to go see what the lighthouse is? Whoa. No! No! You're not funny. Um, have you guys been to the cabin? Do you know what the cabin is? Oh, okay. There's so many secrets um, that are still throughout the map and stuff that I don't know if a lot of people know what this stuff does. Anyhow, the cabin used to be part of the uh, winter 2017 event, 18 event. And what you would do, there were these glow fur trees. And you'd chop up the glow fur trees and you'd toss them inside the, uh, the old fire bin the, over there. Oh, I should have brought some different trees with me because this is going to take forever. Timber! Timber! <coughs> Kick. Timber! Kick. Timber! There it goes. <laughs> took forever. So, let's go ahead and chop down this piece here. And then I'll start chucking some stuff into the chuck chuck wood. Because I would move wood chuck, could chuck wood. Actually, wood chucks don't chuck wood, do they? Okay, so this little thing, you can grab it and lift it, right? And this is a little storage bin. It used to have a gauge down here, and you had to fill up the gauge. The gauge was per person. That way, didn't interfere with the other players but it doesn't actually sell it off I know it makes the ding sound but that's not the the proper sound it's, it's not the sell sound well it is the sell sound but it's not the sell sound I don't know what I'm talking about I do know what I'm talking about it's just I, I don't feel like explaining it too much further but I can direct you over to the wiki that'll have a lot more information on this than I have. Please go in. Please drop in. Did it work? Yay! Ding, ding. Now there's a piece I dropped somewhere. I guess not. Did we get it? We must have got it. So, I'll grab some more. Basically what this is doing, it's not doing anything because the, the event is over and done with, it's gone. But um, the cool effect that happens is whatever wood you put in gets planked and turned into firewood. Not like lava wood, but you'll see. You'll see what I mean here in just a second. If you get enough in there, if you like fill this thing up with like 20 trees, you can make the cabin just glow. So if you're looking for a, a good um, Christmas picture for your avatar, great thing to do is come over here, get your screenshot with it, and then go and get yourself one of those Merry Christmas borders and stick it on there. Great Christmas cards. Oh, that would be an amazing game. Call it Christmas Cards Roblox 2021. And it's just a, a thing where you can like put on Christmas shirts, and pose your avatar in front of a fire and it would take a screenshot like a postcard that way you could hide your hide the HUD and it would take a screenshot <gasps> somebody needs to invent that Christmas card maker Roblox Christmas card maker and then you could just print it out for your parents and hang it on the tree that'd be kinda cool you know, I have the best ideas whenever I'm, like, plain lumber. Just hanging out. Okay, here we go. <gasps> Yay! Firewood. So all that stuff that we put in there, just now, equals out to this. See? We can have a 
Merry Christmas. And then, like slap a border on it. Actually, can I slap a border on something like that? <gasps> Let's do it. Hold on. Um, how do we hold control? How, how do we hide the HUD? Settings, shortcut keys. Okay. Um, move forward, move back, move left, move right, jump. Equip tools, unequip tools, drop tools. Roblox menu, backpack, player list, chat, screenshot. Dev console, graphics level, full screen, preference, stats, rotate. There's supposed to be one. Hmm. Is it control P? Control shift P, control alt P. Hmm. Hold on. I'll do a Google search. How to hide GUI on Roblox. <clears throat> uh, control shift G. Control shift G. Right. Well, that doesn't work. Um, you can also use control shift C. Control shift C. That doesn't work either. Okay. <clears throat> Control Shift C for Max or Command Shift C for Max. Um, you can toggle the GUI on and off by hitting Control Shift G. Control Shift G. Control Shift C B. Control Alt G. Yeah, that's not working. So let's hit tab, get rid of that. Um, this should be good. Okay. <clears throat> so why don't we go grab, hold on, properties, Chrome. There we go. So let's do Christmas card border for pictures. Images, Christmas cards, here we go. <laughs> we need portrait style. Ooh, that's a nice portrait style. Look at that. We like that one? That's a good one. Okay, so I'm gonna right click, uh, copy image. No, I'm gonna save image as, and then, I guess you guys can't see it. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> mm. Ooh, my goodness. Make a wish. <clears throat> you can always wish whenever a, a YouTuber sneezes and it's recorded. That's true. It's very true. But you guys didn't know that. Um, border. There we go. I'm just gonna call it border. And then if I come back over here, hit okay, we can hide that Chrome. And oh, it's, I don't like it with no song. All right, there we go. Let's go outside for the song cut. And let's go, let's see, add image. I'm gonna call this border, browse, desktop, and border. Okay, oh, there it is. Oh, that is so amazing. Okay, hold on. Um, let's go ahead and right click, transform, and stretch to screen. And fade, 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 fade. <clears throat> That's cool. Okay. So now I can just hide my face. And oh, we got to go get set back up. So stand right here in front of the fire. Just like that. Merry Christmas, everyone. Can we hide the can't hide the voice chat thingy? Can I can I turn the voice chat off somehow? Maybe. Anyhow, and then you can put like some text on there. It says Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, whatever you want. And there you have it. You have a nice um, fireplace Christmas. That's awesome. Now I was totally distracted by something. What was, what were we doing? We were, oh, the lighthouse, All right? I forgot. <laughs> Oh man, Christmas cards for everyone. I'm excited for Christmas. 
I'm excited for uh, my birthday. Like, I know a lot of people freak out at 40, and I, I probably will. You know, we're supposed to have this thing called a, a midlife crisis, and that's where people, like, guys will go out and buy motorcycles and Corvettes and stuff like that. I'm, I have no interest in a Corvette. I guess I could go out and buy, like, a really super computer and be like, yeah. I'm young again! But I, I don't know. I don't know what my freakout's going to be. Or if I'll even have one, you know? Um, hey, to my fellow uh, bro Robloxians, men over 40, um, parents, have you had a midlife crisis freakout moment? If so, comment down below. What was it? Share your story with me. If you don't feel like doing that publicly you can always um just dm me on twitter or message me at code primate follow me over there and then tell me oh no tell me your story if you want you don't have to <laughs> excuse me mm. coach you're so disgusting i'm 40 leave me alone i can, I can be whatever i want to be <laughs> Just like you can be anything when you grow up. If you want to be disgusting when you grow up, be disgusting. You know, but be the best disgusting that you can be. <laughs> Gotta give you motivation about it, right? Ooh -ee. Oh gosh. I forgot how much work this is. Oh gosh. Whoa, I almost overcorrected. <laughs> skills. Always gotta always gotta call out skills. In fact we'll we'll type it. Skills. And it's covered up by the microphone. <laughs> S microphone exclamation mark. <laughs> skills. Okay. Let's keep the party going. Right on up. And I think we just go straight off the end here, don't we? We boom. Okay. And now I can jump out, use this, and flip it around. So rotate, turn. Nope. Oh, uh, I guess that works. Oh wait. Are we gonna be able to fit the truck in there? <gasps> oh no. Is the is it going to fit? Oh no. Hmm. I wonder. I've always wondered this. I hear I hear people moving around, so I think it might be my time. My time might be up. So, hold on one second. Yep, I got people moving around. Moving's around. Okay, so let's do this. I don't think I'm supposed to be back here with this. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Oh gosh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, okay. We got a tire stuck somewhere. Where's that other tire at? Oh, no way! Oh, that is awesome. Oh, that is so cool. Okay. Code, what are you doing? I don't know. Just having fun. 
That is so cool. I think this is a first. I think this is a first time for a vehicle to be back here. For those of you that don't know, this was a model that uh, Josh was making on a live stream one time. And it's supposed to be a replica of a place that he knows, that he's been to. Did I hear rumbling somewhere? Did anybody else hear that? Go back in the video and listen to the explosion. Tell me if you heard rumblings. I think I heard something rumble. Anyhow. Oh wait, what's up there? Is there something up there? It looked like there was an edge, but I don't think there is. Looks like there might be an edge over there. There is an edge. Hold on. Oh, guys, can you see? I don't know if you can see or not. All right, cancel, right click filters. We're going to add a color correction filter. And we're gonna turn that gamma way up, contrast way up, brightness way up. Maybe the gamma down, no, nope. brightness down. Don't need to saturate, I guess. Oh, brightness. Oh, there we go. Bring that gamma down a little bit. Bring the brightness up. Gamma down, brightness up. No, that's horrible. Okay. Contrast is way up. Okay, so now we can see in the dark just a little bit. Okay. This is just where the edges come together. It doesn't look like there's... Oh, is there a space gap right there? There is a gap. Hold on. I'm not going to be able to hold that once I get up to the top. Aw, oh, dang it. Dang it. <laughs> Should use a lighter axe. I mean, color-wise. Ah. Oh, shoot. Where did it go? Oh, no, did I leave it up there? Oh, there it is. Okay. All right. Upsy daisy. And now. Upsy. Oh. No. Nope. No gap. look like there was a gap there but there's not hold on did my axe fall down or is it still up here somewhere oh it's down there okay okay i think that is it for the night and i'm not going to be able to glitch my car back up here am i so i think i'm going to call it i'm just going to call it right there you know it's a it was a good episode i liked it Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tech Into with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget, like, comment, and subscribe down below. 
do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. Hit that like button. There's at least a thousand, two thousand people that are watching this out of 138,000. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Outro.